to move on to the next sign. And that next sign is the uh, sign of um, Pisces. We're going to go to Pisces. So let's see what the cards want to share with the sign of Pisces. Pisces. Let's see. Oh, that popped over. Okay. Pisces. Pisces. Let's see what we're telling Pisces. 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 Pisces, 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 Ooh, what a reading, Pisces, 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 wow, Pisces, Ooh, Pisces. Pisces, 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 wow, okay. Okay, Pisces, I'm stopping right there. I, I knew I was going to get to the bottom of it. So Pisces, the first card I see for you is the devil. The devil. And the devil is what the devil represents. I mean, the devil is a devil. I mean, I always tell people that. Like, it is, um, you know, all that the devil represents. It's vices, the grips of addiction, a need for liberation, um, unhealthy versus healthy sexuality, uh, materialism, uh, healing found in the darkness, delving deep in your sh into your shadow self, being trapped in your own stories, manipulation, lying to yourself, temptation. And it's in the darkness, I'm free to heal everything. So there could be some darkness, but you're, you know, you're free to heal once you're there. There is the seven of swords. I sense there's a lot of choices. You might have a lot of decisions <clears throat> that you have to make here with that seven of swords. It might all be mental. It's all mental. I do see the knight of cups and um, someone could be making an emotional offer. I mean, you as a Pisces could be making an emotional offer, or you could be receiving an emotional offer from someone, like someone who might want to date you or make a romantic gesture toward you or might want to hire you or anything like that. I do see that you have the two of swords next, which tells me that you're blinded to whatever this is. Like, you can't see it. You might have to make a decision, but you really don't know. And that's such a Pisces thing to be in that place where a choice has to be made, but you don't know what it is. You don't know what decision to make. Here's the Six of Swords. I do sense that it's time you're going to be moving away from whatever you know it is, um, moving toward a new mental place. That, not being in the same place. Maybe when you pray, you meditate, you center yourself, you ground yourself, stay in your integrity. Right? About grounding yourself. I think maybe this has to do with lovers. Maybe you're making a choice about lovers. I'm not sure. I do sense that after the lover's card, which by the way was the current position card, there's the tower. So you might be making a choice, a decision about love, lovers because of this tower moment. You might be dealing with a Scorpio. You might have been through something and you just feel like it's time. And I feel like whatever it is, you know, be strong. Here's the strength card. Be strong. You have the strength in you to make whatever choice or decision needs to be made. If something needs to end, in order for you to have your, you know, 
emotional stability, then by all means, do whatever it is to save yourself. Um, you know, be strong here. I do think that you're you're waiting and you're testing the waters. Maybe you're testing someone. I think you might want to find out more knowledge before you make a choice. Maybe that's what it is. I think you got the potential to get everything, Pisces. Here's the Ten of Pentacles. And I sense that. Like if this is about a, a established relationship, like a marriage. Um, I see children here. It looks like the husband, the wife, the dog. You know, there's pearls. I mean, it's money. They got the pentacles. I feel like you can do this, but maybe that's why I saw the temperance card. Maybe you need to wait and test things and before you run run off of just your emotion. Here's the nine of cups. Yeah, I think you are going to be able to get your financial and emotional happiness. Look at this picture. It's not beautiful. I mean, it's like when you are at that point of success, I think you've got victory coming. Now, here's the moon. I think, like, I just sense that, and it's, like I say, it's so Piscean not to know. Just don't delude yourself. You know what I mean? Make sure you know. Also, when I see the moon card, it lets me know that you might be able to get the answers for yourself in your sleep. Like when it's sometimes all we need to do is take a rest, just take a nap, take, take a sleeper and the knowledge will come to us. And Pisces, because that's your realm, this is how it'll work for you, especially with this moon card coming up and right after the moon card, what comes up, <laughs> King of Cups. So there you are Pisces in your reading you know, ending your reading King of Cups. And I think it's because you are going to end on your feet. I mean, whatever you're going through, if it's a bad relationship, it's a bad relationship. If it's about money, it's about money. Whatever it is, you're going to end on your feet because you're meant to. I don't think you're meant to stay down low or wherever, uh, you know, this is when we started this. I just sense that... Um, you're meant to rise from that. Now, it, the funniest thing is I noticed, because a couple of extra cards did come out for you in that reading. One, you didn't get any, um, oh, yes, you did. You had two sevens. You have two sevens. And that tells me that, that you're protected. Like Pisces, whatever. Oh, sorry, guys. So sorry. <laughs> this is why I don't do lives, I swear. It's so crazy. Okay, so whatever um, you're going through, I feel like you're protected. You're protected by God and the angels and your, you know, your guardian angel or, oh, I just pulled my shoulder. Oh. Oh. You're protected. Okay, so I, that's, that's what I pick up. Now, you had a lot of major arcana, and I'm just going to read them back. The devil, right? We're dealing with vices. We're dealing with uh, material stuff. We're dealing with sexual things. We're maybe dealing with issues in your relationship, lovers, maybe some problems in your marriage, maybe something ended uh, so you can get a new beginning, um, but maybe something that you were working on ended. It's time for you to be strong now, okay? And take your time. To, to make a decision and make a choice and make sure that you're, you know, you're using your, your mind and you're using your wisdom. Don't just use your emotion because I, sometimes our emotion can deceive us. So a lot, you have the king of cups in this, the moon in this. So it's a lot of emotion here and you're a Pisces. So make sure that you're, you're using, you know, all because at the bottom of the deck is the two of cups. And look at that. That's what I'm saying. Don't just rush off on this tower moment after that lover's card like that and just end everything. Maybe you've got things that have to work out so that you can get back to your two of cups. This is the relationship card. 
So like I was saying, don't just get all up in your emotions. Sometimes we can get fiery all up in our emotions. And um, we'll make a choice and, and later we'll regret that choice. So just know that you could be dealing in a situation like that where you might want to do something, say something, end something. And in your heart, you know you don't want to do it. Don't, you know, I, I can't tell you what to do, but definitely don't do something that would, you know, they say um, cut off your nose to spite your face, that type of thing. Look, there's going to be some big, happy changes coming. So get more information. This is what I'm trying to tell you. Before you go running off a muck, don't do that. Oh, and it says, ask your angels. I told you you're being blessed by your angels, your guardian angels, God himself. I mean, you're being protected here. Oh, a whole bunch of cards came out. Wow. This is, uh, wow. This is obviously a message. I'm taking them from the top. It says, reconsider. Look for a sign. There's something better. Don't stop. Yes. So that's, that's a lot. So if I, I read them back, big happy changes, Pisces. Get more information, Pisces. Ask your angel, Pisces. Reconsider, Pisces. Look for a sign, Pisces. There's something better, Pisces. Don't stop, Pip. Don't stop, Pisces. Yes, Pisces. Yes. Okay. That's the message. <laughs> I had to say it just like that, too. I mean. <laughs> Astrology. A look inside. Presenting astrology and tarot readings for all.